This is where they were working most of the time because apparently this this whole tree went up. Walking through what was until 12 hours ago, a thick grove covered in like dead trees and stuff all through here. Jeff Varlin tours the edge of Monday's 75 acre brush fire in Verina that came within feet of his and his neighbors homes. It's pretty overwhelming. You, you realize how much you're at, sort of at the mercy of um, an element like fire. Hope we don't get over this way. I know. Varlin took this video shortly before 530, saying 45 minutes earlier he would only smelled smoke and thought it was just a fire pit. And it goes from zero to 100 pretty fast. <laughs> How to put it out. And as his two year old son Peter explains it, this brought out a lot of firefighters. There are three. three? I think there are a few more than three. It's it's scary when it when it's running that hard. Henrico Fire Battalion Chief Doug Reynolds says the cause was someone having an outdoor fire. And it just goes to show how dry these conditions all it took was a, a small ember to get away to start a bigger fire. In terms of what firefighters faced, Reynolds says brush fires are more unpredictable than house fires, especially with the windy conditions. So it takes a lot of firefighters, a lot of equipment. You know, we had pretty much an engine at every house to be able to protect it in case that fire got past that fence. So we had some damage to the outside, but everything inside is OK. Our house fine. Firefighters were successful in that effort, keeping it from the main homes, but the shed at K. Macklin's family house was burned and the heat melted the garage siding. Reynolds is also giving credit to a neighbor who came by as they were nearing the end of the fight and used his tractor to dig a fire line to keep the flames from spreading. We protect the neighborhood. Bill Nelson lives nearby, but says he was working this field about five miles away when his wife called and he came to help. Reynolds called him a hero, but Nelson says it's the other way around. The Henrico Fire did a they did a tremendous job. I mean they I don't know how they control as much as they do. I'm just a neighbor that took care of the took care of my neighbors. State officials say Henrico is just one example of what's been a very active fire season with nearly 500 wildfires and over 20,000 acres burned. Stressing the importance of fire prevention and, and home things that homeowners can do. Um, you know, removing the leaf litter from their gutters, making sure the um, the grass is cut low. Meanwhile, back home in Verina, Varlin and others are just thankful it was only property that was burned in this case and are grateful for the firefighters who kept it from getting worse. I had never seen that many fire trucks before in my life in one area, so I'm really thankful for them. They did a great job. They, you know, they live up to all the hype that, that we give them. And members of the fire marshal's office have been out investigating this blaze as well, and we are awaiting an update from them in that investigation, including the possibility of charges against the person responsible for the fire. In Henrico County, Cameron Thompson, CBS 6 News.